Welcome back. People are living longer and with age comes a unique set of health concerns. Yes, and joining us now is Dr. Parveen Khanna, the Medical Director at Pain Medicine Physicians, and Kathy Wright is a certified nurse practitioner. Uh, they say their team really specializes in helping people optimize their health before they run into challenges. Ladies, it's so good to see you. Thanks Thank for you. joining us. Great to be right, here. So let's talk a little bit first about uh, you primarily treat, a, what do you primarily treat, I should say, in your clinic? Well, I'm an anesthesiologist, fellowship trained in interventional pain medicine and uh, so my focus is on uh, managing patients pain we can't really cure any diseases so uh, I help them manage uh, uh, the pain from any disease that could cause pain and improve the quality of life because that can be debilitating for a lot of people just being able to regain you know their life and what they enjoy living and doing absolutely mm -hmm. yeah and i'm dealing with a little bit of back pain right now from my previous career as a stuffed animal so i'm wondering <laughs> I, this question is, is personal to me what what's uh, the most important consideration for me or somebody out there when deciding on a pain management clinic i think when you're looking around uh, for a pain clinic you should have in your mind that you want a patient-centered clinic so you look at the at the expertise of the staff make sure that they have credentials to back them that it's not just some fly in the on the night uh, buzzing around trying to help someone's pain um, and that you get trust and respect from the staff from the moment that you walk in to the moment that you leave and that you feel welcome in the environment right is there is there hope really for some people such as Curtis <laughs> <laughs> well that's a whole, other, question, a whole other day <laughs> We could but, try. But he really does. I mean, honest to goodness, he really suffers with pain from his back from what he did mm -hmm. in his previous life. Is, is there help for people to manage their chronic pain? It, it, you need to seek out the help, first of all, right? Yes. Well, there are a lot. Uh, uh, right now, there are a lot of things you can do, not just the pain medication. I mean, that, uh, I'm not even going to bring that up, uh, thinking about the opioid epidemic. Yeah. Uh, you can uh, force. Uh, try to change your posture, physical therapy, uh, regular exercises to uh, strengthen your core muscles. Yeah. And then the interventional procedures like uh, everybody heard of uh, epidural steroid injections or facet injections. You can burn those nerves with radio frequency waves uh, because they're sensory nerves that like supply the facet joints. Yes. <laughs> they grow back. It takes about yeah. a year, but sure. you have a year to strengthen your core muscles uh, and lose weight. But that you know, additionally, lot. there's uh, non-invasive things. Some people are so needle phobic, the thought of needles yeah. just throws them over the edge. And so we focus in our clinic on addressing those sort of non-invasive things as well. We mm -hmm. have um, laser light therapy that my patients just love. I've had so many patients that come in with a pain score of 8 over 10 and and we send them to do their 15 minute procedure at laser light in our clinic and they leave with a pain score of one or two. Wow. And so we, we've done the literature review on those types of interventions and they're very successful in patients. It's, it's a class them. four laser light therapy versus the class three that the chiropractors have. This uh, actually works. <laughs> <laughs> right. You have, a, you have to have a little bit more, I'm sure. Uh, oh, uh, yeah. Absolutely. Yes. Uh, something else you mentioned uh, as we were talking about. Uh, Age management. You yes. guys, you guys deal with that. Tell me what age management yes. is. Age man is, management is a way of approaching medicine to focus more on, on uh, dealing with illness before the illness occurs. As we all age, our body degenerates a bit. Every single day from the day we're born, you know, we, we kick a lot no, of no, cells down it. the yeah. road. <laughs> and so age management tries to look at that when you're in your 30s and 40s and say, okay, what's functioning and what's not functioning? So we look at all of the systems objectively and try to put it together from an objective standpoint point what's working what's not working what can we measure that's working well and optimize what's not and it's really a unique thing right very because, unique yeah yes. looking in and this is what we kind of alluded to at the beginning of the segment it's that you're looking to help people with any issues before they arise right, right? being and proactive, proactive rather versus than reactive. reactive yes i mean it's a catchphrase now but i believe in that let's address things yeah. before they get to be so bad that that then you have terrible chronic pain. Preventative is always easier. Ladies, okay. thank you appreciate so much. It's so, so good much. to see you. Welcome yes. to the show. We thank appreciate you so your much. time. Thanks for having us. Thanks. We'd like to thank Pain Medicine Physicians for making this segment possible. For more information, visit pmpjax.com or call 904-495-7200.